the dude, he said that, like, when we were making the first Linkin Park record, he was like, yeah, you know, I don't know about the rapping. Like, I don't know if it's, like, maybe you should just be a rock band. You know what I mean? Like, trying to change us. Like, they signed us as an act, like, what we sound like. Yeah. And then he's like, oh, I don't know. Maybe you should just play keyboard. Before the first song that you heard me on, there were people already trying to get me gone. Telling me to quit rapping, just play the keys. Then my band had a singer, they didn't need me. But my band had my back, so we did the tracks. Put out the album and the talk went flat. It was funny at first, but then the humor faded when some magazines printed that our label made us. We were too good to be true. Some were saying ghost writers were writing all that we do, so we had to disprove it. We spelled it out to the detail how we do it when we're making this music. After that, I made it a rule. I only do email responses to printing a views because these people love to put a twist to your words to infer that you said something fucking absurd. Oh, did I lose you would infer? Not used to hearing a verse that uses over first grade vocabulary words. People used to infer that we were manufactured. Now I got the interviews on file. Which people said what? Which number to dial? So now every enemy screaming insanity. All they're ever gonna be is another big fan of me, bitch. You believe that? Like, that's crazy. Sounds crazy, right? Like, this one. At this point, you think you're, you hear that, you're like, that guy was out of his mind. But honestly, at that point, besides the fact that he wanted me to just play keyboard and whatever, he didn't want me to rap, he was like, maybe Joe Han should um, wear a lab coat and a cowboy hat. On st like, when we play. <laughs> I swear to God, he's crazy. It was a crazy cowboy hat. Later on he claimed that he wrote our, all our songs, so that was...